important to master the movement pattern. Uh, this must be done repetition after repetition. And the best way is to do it as slowly as possible so you start to ingrain that into your long-term memory. Once you have that skill movement, we want to add speed to that to see it breaks down. That's our level two. Our level three would be adding speed and doing it under fatigue to see if the movement pattern can hold up. Our level four is adding speed with fatigue with pressure. It doesn't hold up. And our fifth and final level is we need to do it with speed, under fatigue, with pressure, and consistently. If the motor program can hold up and the skill can withstand those variables, it's located deep, deep in long-term memory. And then we need to get in a game-like scenario to see if it can handle the real thing.